Hello class, this is Dr. Fenton. I'm recording this video because when I reviewed your videos, I noticed that after you had Tegrity started, and that's what I have now, I'm using Tegrity, you really didn't know how to get started with the exam. And I saw you moving your cursor around, going from page to page, trying to figure out how to get the exam started. It's quite easy, so I want to make this quick video to show you how to get the exam started, and also to show you what your exam will look like uh, when I review it later on. So, I have uh, two monitors here, so my camera is on my laptop computer I'm looking at right now, but my main screen is over here. So I'm going to be looking over here, uh, that's why I'm looking sideways to the camera for a few minutes here. Now once you get Tegrity started, and before you start the exam, you need to you know, show your workspace. So what most of you end up doing is uh, picking up your computer, and showing the camera around, show you don't have any books, open notes around, no one else in the room, and um, you know, make sure you do that before you start the exam. Okay. Uh, if you start Tegrity and you're at your, your uh, uh, McGraw Hill page, your Connect page, then it'll look like this, or at least go to the home key if you haven't already, click home, and then it'll show something similar to this. Mine looks a little bit different because I'm the instructor here. But scroll down for the exam. And we did the bonus exam a few minutes ago. But you can start the exam, our bonus exam here. Or if your Connect is not uh, showing, go back to your, your Canvas page, go to Syllabus, and then scroll down and you can click on your exam here. So this is the bonus exam, and this is the exam that will be started uh, Sunday, uh, January 26 at 400 points. So you can start here after you have Tegrity started, not before, but after. So make sure you get Tegrity started, and I have another video to show how to do that. Once you get started, then start the exam either from the syllabus page here, or go to the Connect page and start right here. So if I, uh, uh, let me just pull up the bonus exam. I'll start here. And this is what I see, um, because again, I'm the instructor here, and yours will start automatically. It might give you another uh, question about whether you're ready to start or something like that. Click and get started. I'm going to preview it, uh, and these are the kind of questions that you did see on the bonus exam, or you will see. And, you know, the income statement looks something like this. You go to the next question. And you'll fill that out, and you know, use drop-down menus to select which, which accounts the correct account. And you type in the numbers that, that you need, and get to the third page, and prepare your balance sheet. Okay. And then when you're ready, on your screen, you will have a uh, submit button somewhere up here in the upper right-hand corner. Click submit, then I think it'll ask you again, are you ready to submit? And if you left any questions blank, it'll, it'll tell you you did that. Uh, go back and, and correct everything, fill everything in, and then come back and submit. Hit submit, it'll ask you, are you ready? Are you sure? Click submit, yes, and then it'll show you the grade. So I want to see the grade before you stop the grade. So that, that's the whole thing. This is how to get started in the exam, go through the exam, and then submit the exam. After you've submitted, you've seen the grade. Uh, I know some of you are looking around trying to figure out how do you stop the grade. Just go down to the bottom, and hopefully this is showing up at the screen here. And there's this black square that stops integrity. So as soon as I click this, you will not be able to see it anymore. I'm going to click it. I think you're going to get one question. Yes. Are you ready to record the exam? Now, when you do this, you hit yes here, it stops the exam. That's all I can see. I notice when I stop this, it tells me it's going to upload the exam to integrity. And that's for me to view it later. Don't turn your computer off just yet. It takes a few minutes, or maybe a, a, a few more minutes, to load the exam of integrity. I think that happened last semester. Some people were turning off their, their uh, computer as soon as they were finished with their exam, and it did not upload until they turned it on next time, and to find where the video was on their computer, and then manually upload it. Don't do that. Leave your computer on for at least an hour, and let it upload itself to integrity. So I think that's it. I'm going to click on yes here to end the recording, and that's all you're going to be able to see.